Good morning. It is Friday, May 22nd, and I am back here from bed with bed talk number 47. And I'm not sure, but this may be the shortest bed talk of all of them because it's a very simple concept. I want to talk to you today about an eyeful of gratitude. Let me say it again, an eyeful of gratitude. I mentioned this kind of offhand on a webinar this week, and a lot of people on the webinar were saying, wow, that's such a great idea. And I thought, what do you mean a great idea? Isn't everyone already doing this? Well, if we're not, this is the invitation to start. And it's this simple. Whenever you engage with anyone right now, and frankly, in the future, why not do it all the time? Someone who's serving you, someone who's at the drive through window taking your payment or giving you your food, or you go in to get your food at a restaurant, or you're checking out at the grocery store and you're at the cashier or the bagger. It's a really simple process. Give them all an eye full of gratitude. And here's what it looks like. You pause, look them in the eye, and say these words. Thank you for being here. That's it. Thank you for being here. Five words, two eyes, an eye full of gratitude. It makes a difference. I've seen people light up. Some people deflect it and say, oh, it's nothing. But I'll tell you, almost everyone says, wow, thank you. I appreciate that. Or you're welcome. That's it. Offer an eye full of gratitude to everyone you interact with, especially those who are serving you, and especially, especially those who are there for you and I and all of us when they don't have to be or when it's difficult to be or it's in those challenging situations. It's a gift to us that they are there, especially during this time. And I would say, why not do it all the time? Make it a new habit, a new muscle. Give everyone you interact with an eye full of gratitude with five words. Thank you for being here. And I say the same to all of you. Thank you for being here. See you tomorrow.